Hey there. In this playlist, we'll be learning how to use the Gradio library in Python. You'll discover how to create interactive interfaces for your machine learning models and Python functions, all with just a few lines of code. Gradio is perfect for quickly turning your projects into accessible applications that are easy to share, test, and visualize. So let's get started. Before we dive into the code, I created a virtual environment for this project. The reason for using a virtual environment is to keep all dependencies separate from your system's Python installation. This ensures that your project won't conflict with other projects or system packages. You can easily set up a virtual environment by running the following command python -m venv venv. Once the virtual environment is created, you need to activate it. On Windows, this can be done by running the activate.bat file located in the venv scripts folder. To activate it, simply run venv scripts activate.bat. If you see venv in your terminal, it means you've successfully activated the virtual environment. After activating the virtual environment, I installed the required packages using the following command pip install Gradio. This installs Gradio in the virtual environment, allowing us to use it for our project. Package installation is complete. Now let's create the main.py file and start building our first project. In this project, we will create a simple application using Gradio that allows users to add two numbers together. First, we import the Gradio library with the line import Gradio as gr, this imports Gradio and gives it an alias GR, so we can use this shorter version throughout our code. Next, we define a simple function addNumbers that takes two inputs, adds them together, and returns the sum. After that, we create the interface using GR.interface, where we specify the function addNumbers to be used. We define two input fields for the numbers the user will enter, and one output field to display the sum. Finally, we use interface.launch to open the Gradio interface in the browser, allowing us to interact with it by entering numbers and seeing the sum calculated in real time. After creating the main.py file and writing the code, I will run the application. Once the app is running, it will display a URL in the terminal. I can then open this URL in my browser where the Gradio interface will appear. I will enter two numbers into the input fields and click the button to calculate the sum. As expected, the sum of the numbers will be displayed in the output field. After that, I can use the clear button to reset the inputs and outputs which will clear the data and allow me to start fresh with new inputs. See you in the next project.